Hey guys, welcome to the session on Coffee with Prab and today we are going to discuss about how to prepare for CISSP exam in free. Free, free, free. Exactly. You are in the right channel where I am going to discuss about the step by step process from the day 1 to day 30. How with the free resource, uh, not a complete free but yeah a combination. With the help of that you can able to clear the CISSP new exam 2024 in a one month. So before going to watch this video do subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon to make sure you should not miss my future videos and if you talk about my profile you can check my LinkedIn. I have a 17 plus year of experience in the information security and I'm taking a CISSP from last approx 12 year. So without wasting a time let's start with the first part. Thank you. Okay, so in this video, I have divided the entire activity or step by step process in four or five steps. The first step is that videos. Exactly. I always recommend to start preparing for CISSP from videos. So there are two resources which I highly recommend if you want to start the CISSP with videos. The first is called as a Mr. Thor Peterson. His videos are there on a Udemy. Okay, very cost effective, very to the point, detailed one video that you can basically refer. And the second video which I would recommend is Mr. Pete Cram videos which is on YouTube. So for more information you can check in my description box. I will share the playlist of that particular guy. Now Pete Cram videos are free videos which is available on YouTube. And Thor Peterson are the paid videos which is available on the Udemy. So these are the two primary videos you can refer while preparing for the exam. And I highly recommend start with the videos first because videos will give you the explanatory topics. Video will explain you the topic in more detailed manner than it is easy for you to read in the book. So that is the first part. That is a book. You have to start with the book first. Okay. Now after watching either Thor video or Pete Cram videos, now you got the visibility. Now second is, shall I refer any book? Definitely. The book, if you already having a ninth edition Cybex, that is enough. That is still enough because the compensatory, the new topics for that Thor, uh, Mr. Pete has already covered in his YouTube video. But you know, if you don't have any book, then wait till June 10 or June 15. The 10th edition of Cybex is going to be rolled out by Mr. Mike Chappell. So it is a Cybex official guide. Mike Chappell is the author and his 10th edition book is basically a very good book which give you the better visibility about the CISSP. So the, from a book perspective, the, CB, the Cybex 10th edition that you can refer or if you already have in the 9th edition that is decent enough. So that is the book part. Now after referring to the book pointers and all that you know. So the best thing about the Cybex book they have organized the domains into chapters. So in CISSP we basically have a 8 domains. They organize into the 8 domain because domains are representing as a department. Okay, because once you clear the CISSP exam, you need to demonstrate your five years of experience in any two domain. So that is why the CISSP organized the content in a form of domain. But Mike Chappell's Cybex book, which is a ninth or new, which is called 10th edition, have organized all the particular eight domains into 21 chapters. So I highly recommend when you reviewing those chapters, okay, in the first page of the book, you can see how many chapters are mapped with particular domain. So they organize the things into domain plus mapping with chapters. Now let's take an example, how to read book. If you want to understand how to read book, please check this particular video, which I already uploaded on YouTube because it will really help you to save your time. Now I'm imagining like you have completed the domain one video from Pete Cram or Thor. Now you refer the domain one from the Mike Chappell book. After that, you want to get the more clarity. So I already have my coffee shots. For domain one, I have uploaded some of the coffee shot. Now what is coffee shot? Coffee shot basically means for some topics, I have created some questions because I personally believe to understand the topic more in detail, you can basically map with the questions because questions give you more clarity. So after completing domain one, you can refer those coffee shots. Example like I already created a coffee shots for the risk management, uh, BCP, threat modeling, risk appetite, all these coffee shots, compliance, all are there. So first domain one video, then domain one book, then coffee shots. So this is basically solidify your concept. So 
complete is book has so just assuming that okay you have completed the book you completed the video and from there you basically prepare the notes now one more important thing is that after every chapter there is a key exam summary is there in a cybex please 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 refer that summary because that is the most important point of every chapter do not skip that i repeat after every chapter there is a exam summary is there make sure you should refer the exam summary because that is the most important blueprint of the exam so i am assuming you done with the book you done with the videos you done with the coffee shop now it is in a stage where you have to practice questions so second part of this video we going to discuss about what are the different source of practice questions you have to refer okay so second part of this particular video we going to discuss about the practice questions okay in my previous video okay uh, i always refer some key pointers of practice questions and all that but today i can say there's a new source is out which is also give you good visibility of the practice questions so first question bank which is a mobile app called as a learn z app okay in the description box i can share see i am not getting any paid uh, you can say partnership cost something from this okay it is just a informative video which i want to create which give you awareness so there is no promotion video and all that and that company doesn't paying me anything so neither mike chapel is paying neither uh, this learn z app company is paying i am just sharing what i basically refer to my paid customers okay so learn z app is the first practice question bank you should refer now what is the benefit of learn z app now in learn z app they have more than 5000 questions and those questions are basically mapped with the topics okay let's take example you are referring to the risk management okay now you need to understand how the question can be framed so learn z app basically have those questions which is mapped with that particular topic one thing you need to understand in cissp you cannot clear the exam by just reading a book you have to practice more and more questions understand that's a very important part so first question bank is basically called as a learn z app okay now i'm assuming you done with the learn z app questions now during the questions you identifying some questions in which having a vague terms words and all that now note down all those pointers okay i am getting repetitive mistakes in bcp i am getting repetitive mistakes in cryptography so make a note of that and refer points those points again from the cybex book okay how to read cybex i have shared again so there's a video i already uploaded on youtube it will save your time it will save your time please 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 check that video okay so so second question bank is basically called as a boson see when you talking on boson again boson company doesn't uh, paying me for that content okay i'm just sharing what i got the feedback so boson question bank is basically the language is somehow you get the same kind of exam but not same but that give you visibility so you can say maturity of learn z app is to give you visibility of cybex question then you move to the next level where you get a holistic view how to think like a manager and all that for that i refer the boson question the third question bank i highly recommend you must do you must do which is called as a my brother book which is called as a luke amad 25 questions two major advantage of doing those question bank one it give you visibility about how to think like a manager second it give you visibility about how to handle the technical question that guy has spent more than a year for that book and the book has a great success story so my humble recommendation is refer that particular book so that you can get those those 25 questions give you more visibility about how to think like a manager so summary is that three practice questions first start with the learn z app that give you quick summary quick recap of what is in the cybex second is basically called boson which give you more maturity about how to think like a manager identical to the real exam kind of a thing but not like that but you get a visibility and the third is basically called as a luke ahmed think like a manager question bank fourth question bank is also so if you're not comfortable to pay learn z app and all that then mike chapel i think fourth edition question bank will be out by next month so that you can check but i highly recommend learn z app question you can basically check okay that's the most important thing one more important thing before you start with all these questions right all these four set of questions on all that before that there is a one video you must watch is andrew ramdeal video see i don't have any kind of insecurity in promoting other trainers because my end goal is to give you the awareness okay i highly recommend even i recommend this video to my participants when they go for the question bank so before you going to practice learn it app questions before you going to practice your boson questions or luke ahmed think like a manager check this video first 
this guy has basically created a visibility about how to think like a manager how to eliminate and all that so this is video is a very good video is an eye opener video for you to how to think like a manager another video i highly recommend is miss kelly henderson her video is a 15 minutes video which talk about the cisc principle and the third video is a very important video of dabnair who have created think like a manager and all that so that videos you can basically refer now we done with the this uh, what you called uh, question banks and all that now we moving to the next part the third part which is called as a important thing that you have to refer two weeks before the exam so i am assuming in 20 days okay four hour a week day and eight hour a weekend in two three weeks you have complete all these things now most most important part here is basically what should we do two weeks before the exam because it's not possible for you to refer book again so i highly recommend one video which you must watch is destination certification mind map see now you are in a position you understood everything but how to connect so this mind map which is more than 10 hour quality content upload on the youtube which is called destination certification robert video john john bharti so these videos are basically very important because it give you the holistic view of all the connectors and then from there you make a notes so i am assuming you have made the final notes okay so after reviewing the destination certification cybex books and all that now you need a quick summary so there is another book you must must watch or oh, sorry must read which is called as a memory palace by prashant mohan my brother he did amazing job he already launched the latest version of memory palace so what is the benefit of memory palace is it is a it's like a summary it is like a crisp summary of all the books which is required for you to clear the exam he really did amazing job and there's a lot of success story talk about the prashant mohan memory palace so refer that particular book okay week before the exam so summary is that start with the videos get the clarity to validate the clarity read the cybex 9th edition if you want you can also refer the all in one uh, which is called sean harris book once you done with this you move to the question practice start with a randy ramdeal video which give you understanding about how to eliminate questions and all that and then you can basically refer the kelly video once you get the clarity from there you start with the practice questions the first is called as learn z app which is like a uh testing the knowledge of cybex which is a very good book uh, it's a very good app then they have a second question bank which is called boson third is think like a manager liu kamath and after that two week before the exam you can basically refer the mind map videos of destination certification and prashant mohan memory palace from all these things you have to create only two page note and that note should be refer three week three days before the exam because you don't have a time to refer everything and all that so it's very important you need to you know re review all these things so make sure i miss one point after every domain reading after videos and reading you should refer my coffee shorts i'm not promoting my coffee shorts like that but there's a reason for that because every coffee short which i have created it is topic wise so if you talk about cryptography domain 4 domain 8 all those videos i already uploaded on youtube channel if you want updated playlist domain wise drop me a comment i will basically share the google drive link for that okay so that is the most important part so this is basically all about the preparation that you have to follow in sequence now second part of this particular video where i want to explain you how to think and what to think when you preparing for cissp okay now i explain you what is the sequence you have to follow see i highly recommend you start your day with cissp only so example like your mind is fresh okay so first two hour of your day before you preparing for yourself office and all that you can start with the videos and in the night before sleeping review the notes because what i'll tell you reason why i highly recommend to study in the morning because see you already spend your 9 to 10 hours in the office and after that exhaustedness and all that you going to concentrate it is difficult so your mind is basically very fresh your mind is very focused in the morning so i highly recommend okay i highly recommend to do the all the reading stuff video stuff and practice questions in the morning and what are the revisions you have before going to sleep you basically review those topics and before going to sleep do manifestation okay i am thinking i am a manager if i'm using symmetric cryptography this is how i'm doing a data encryption so that memory with manifestation will help you retain the topic so do not read the book only for a sake of 
clearing the exam understand why behind the topic it's a very important part i'll explain with the example symmetric cryptography is basically you same key to encrypt and decrypt the data if you remember like this you will not able to remember the things but understand the use case okay it use same key to encrypt decrypt the data because it is basically faster why in asymmetric was introduced to e exchange okay now domain 4 now in domain 4 do i need to read so detailed technical things no i'm reading ipsec ipsec is a protocol suit which is used to protect the ip packets right but exam is all about why okay until once your why is not clear you cannot able to understand the concept okay i understood ipsec used to protect the pack packet suit okay so you have a clarity how ipsec work then only know how the ipsec use in the company is it clear like ipsec is a protocol security so ipsec work on layer 3 understood so that is how you need to understand so until you don't know how ipsec work you won't able to answer the question in the exam now let's take another example is firewall firewall is a device which is used to protect the organization from external attack so how firewall works you should know high level that is why you can able to answer in the exam if the question talking about any problem statement okay you are a security consultant company want to implement solution to protect from external attacks oh okay answer is firewall because you refer you read the firewall in the cybex so when you're reading a domain 3 and domain 4 don't do deep technical understand high level how it works use chat gpt and with that reference you can basically prepare the topic that's the most important part now second most important part when you're doing a preparations and all that is when you practice questions do practice question in the morning and all the revisions do in the evening for those points that's the most important part the day before the exam day before the exam and do ramdal video and all your summary notes that you prepare that you should refer that's it and by evening just relax morning don't do anything if you have a morning exam because you want to use your 3 hour of energy in that particular exam so my recommendation is basically don't do anything in the morning the day of the exam so this is all from my side do let me know how do you find this particular video and do share your suggestions and comments in the comment box which help me to improve the video please note because without of without you i am nothing okay this channel is basically today standard 90000 subscriber because of you if you have not subscribed to the channel do subscribe so you get more knowledgeable content from my side hope you find this video and do share your network for more information thank you so much